I don't know if it's 915 or not. I think Vicki is telling me, Vicki and Amy, that it is 915 and I need to get going. So, welcome to our Facebook Live. Thank you for joining us. Uh, we have a few things to show you and today we're going to do an unboxing. So, I'm very excited. Let's start, Vicki, with the quilt, I think, behind me because I think that's the way your camera is pointed and you're all sneezing. This is a winter panel that we have here at the shop, and uh, I don't, it hasn't been selling that well, so I threw it together in a quilt. Ashley Ruth made this sample for us, and we quilted it up. This is the winter cabin with the stormy weather. I love it, the snow, and I'm ready for the snow, so bring it on. You know that panels go together very quickly, and they are the perfect, perfect Christmas gift. So look how many panel patterns we have. That's just a few of them. This is six different panel panels, panel patterns I have in my hand. This is not all of them. And for this one, I did Bayview, which is so simple. It's just these rectangles and the panel and the border. So um, I am inviting you to come take a look at the winter panels that we have left and get busy sewing your last minute row. Speaking of panels, the next one I was going to show you was this one. Now this one's not finished. I've been like kind of custom quilting it at home. So, but I, and, and I didn't get it finished this weekend, but I brought it in anyway to show you guys that this is a great simple wall hanging. Literally, all I did was put a border on it with the new Kate shot cotton. Did a little stitch in the ditch on the border. If you didn't do anything else, that would work. But I also did some, like, just some quick, like, spiky threads in the pine needles. It went together so fast, and I was going to do some red on the cardinals and be done. Again, another panel, one border, some stitching on your quilt. I did it on the long arm and was taking care of Jennifer and getting distracted and so I didn't get it finished, but you can finish it in less than a day, I guarantee you, because it doesn't have to be tricky, it doesn't have to be elaborate, it can be something really simple that sandwiches these layers together and you've made a stitch in the ditch on your border stripe because it looks great. So uh, those are the two panel quilts I wanted to show you. That was not a pattern, literally, that was a panel with a border. The other thing I wanted to show you before we do our unboxing is this quilt kit, this quick kit. I don't know if you know this, but we have gotten in several new Villa Rosa patterns. Our wall is now full and restocked again. And this is one that's called Switched. Simple, simple pattern. Vicki did this sample for us. And it's literally a four patch. You cut a piece off, re-sew it, and you're done. Um, that, let me show the quilt first. This is a quilt. This is a fall line that we have 10 inch stackers on. So these are 10 inch layer cake pieces. And uh, because it's fall, it has the fall leaves, the persimmons, the fall fruit, the great, mm, um, fall flowers, but I love the blenders on this and it was so simple to go together There's the layer cake Looks kind of wintry if you took out the grapes you would have you know the sparkle Can you tell from here Vicki that it has the gold metallic in it? It might yes. be a little hard to see But we will have this up front if you would like to see it It went together very quickly and there are lots of new Villa Rosa patterns that include uh, using a 10 inch square. So uh, we still have plenty of Christmas pre-cuts, pre including a green one that you can make a Christmas tree out of and the Christmas miniatures that we love so much. And so that's what I was going to say about our two panels and our pre-cuts for fall and Christmas and our new Villa Rosa pattern. So let's get to the fun and exciting um, part of this show, we have an unboxing to do today. So here I am with the box cutter. Ruth encouraged me to do this thing. Oh, this one looks kind of geometric. 
This one was called, do you remember, Vicki, what this is called? The language of color. And so it's got these cool, funky little uh, geometric prints. Oh, here's a newspaper print. The meaning of this is all newsprint about different colors. What a unique piece this is. Oh, and it's got some um, focus pieces. This, these two colorful pieces with the dots. Don't even have to applique the dots on yourself. And this one, I think is flowers if you unroll it. We're gonna show it, well, we're gonna get it inventory. Oh, and here is a panel. Here, Rid, bring me that other box. Let's see what's in there. Let me see, I, let me see if I can unroll the panel really quickly. Is that worth it? Do you wanna take those out, Ruth, and let's see yeah. what's in there. This is a Mandela. Pretty. Yeah, it is pretty. We've got patterns for this. That's border prints. We've got a pattern for this. So we're just going to sew up this sample for us really quick. Look forward to seeing it in the store probably by next week. And uh, thanks for joining us today. You guys have a great day. Vicki, did I leave anything out? Not that I can think of. No? Just okay, pull the rest guys. of us out. It is pretty, and we've yeah. got the border print to go on the on the pattern. So we'll see you soon. Thank you, guys.